Welcome to today's lesson. Now, I was asked recently by one of my visitors to do something on tangents and normals. So here's a quick intro lesson covering some of the basics and hopefully this proves to be useful. Now I'm going to consider this question here, which says we have a function y equals x squared. We have a point two four. And what I want to do is to find the equation of the normal at that point. Okay, well, this all sounds fairly straightforward. Now, the first thing I like to do is to draw a quick sketch of the function. So here I have y equals x squared, and I'm going to mark in the point two, four. Now, what I'm going to do is to draw in the tangent at the point two, four. And the reason I'm doing that is just so we can see what's going on. I need to calculate the gradient at the point two, four, so that I can find the gradient of the normal. Now it's quite easy to do this. I could draw in a vertical line. I could draw in a horizontal line. Vertical change is four, horizontal change is one. Therefore the gradient is four. Now I know to work out the gradient of the normal, it's negative one over that value. In other words, the gradient of the normal is negative one over four. Now that's all well and good on a very simple example like this, but I don't want to be drawing vertical lines and horizontal lines all the time. So what I can do is I can use the gradient function. So what I'm going to say is that I've got y equals x squared. I'm going to differentiate that. So dy by dx, and that is 2x. Now I'm trying to find the gradient at the point 2, 4. So I know the x ordinate is 2. So when x equals 2, we know that dy by dx, well, that's going to equal 2 multiplied by 2, which is 4. So the gradient is 4 at the point 2, 4. Well, we knew that. Now let me just draw in the normal. Now the normal is perpendicular to the tangent. And we already know that the gradient is negative one over the gradient of the tangent. So the gradient of this normal is negative one over four. Now to work out the equation of the normal, all I need to do is to use the general form for the equation of a straight line. So I can use y minus y1 is equal to m x minus x1. Now I already know what m is, we worked that out earlier that m is negative 1 over 4. And I know what x1 and y1 are. Well, x1 and y1, well, that's the point 2, 4. So popping all those values into here, I get that y minus 4 is equal to negative a quarter x minus 2. Now let's go ahead and tidy things up a bit. I'm going to multiply everything through by 4. So 4y minus 16 is equal to, and expand this bracket here, I get negative x plus 2. Rearranging the x and y terms and the constants, I'm going to get 4y plus x is equal to 18. And that's the equation of the normal at the point 2, 4. If you found this video useful, then remember to give me a quick thumbs up and if you would like to be notified when I release new videos, then hit that subscribe button and remember to click on the little notification bell.